Ja, den här. Vi kan tjusa i färg på den. I want to review. Mm. Really good. It does. Quite a heavy aftertaste. Almost like a little spike up. Is it sweet or is it? No, oh, not very sweet. It's good. It's really good. Let me taste it. There's some a biscuit, like some. Mm, there is some kind of tanginess in it. Yeah, but it's good. And extremely healthy. And extremely healthy. Yes. <laughs> this is an energy boost. Mm. To do butter, you need cream. Heavy cream that you can whip. It's like taking your destiny into your own hands. It's some kind of sustainability and you know exactly what's in it. No preservatives, no stabilizers. It's just cream, salt and I also put in some olive oil. But you don't have to put oil in it. Or you can put some other oil. For example, canola oil, which is more neutral in its taste. This is the one. I'm in a shop, what name I can't say, but it's the only shop in Sweden where the prices did not raise as much as the others. See here, you have to stand in line for quite a while. So I will not buy the cream here. It doesn't take many minutes to whip this. I whip for like seven minutes and it's all done. You whip, whip, whip and it becomes butter and the butter separates the buttermilk. This liquid you can use for, I don't know, your flowers or when you bake. It's really nutritious. Honestly, I did a mistake. I over whipped it, stupid. But it's not like it can't be saved. I just put it through a sieve so that the buttermilk can drain and then we are good to go again. You would do me a big favor if you just put a thumb and if you are not subscribing, please do. Of course, only if you like what you see. And then it's time to go into the vessel. You have your own butter and it's so cheap. I mean, it's a lot of money you save. It's maybe half the price or something when you do it with uh, heavy cream. And, well, because of the olive oil, I guess, uh, it's, it's soft as well. I whipped it a little bit too long. So what did you whip? Uh, well, I whipped heavy cream. And it must be the one with the most fat content that you can find on the market. And then you just whip and whip and whip. And then the, there is some buttermilk separated from the butter. It's amazing. Actually, I learned it in school. When I was nine years old, my teacher did it. Okay. Yeah. And, uh, and you added olive oil? I added olive oil and my own herb salt. Actually, I'm going to taste it. Mm, there is a taste of olive oil. I think it's good. Taste it. <laughs> Uh, not butter, just like that for me. You the most <laughs> smart. <laughs> yeah, it's really good. It's it's delicious almost. You yeah, say. and what's nice is that it doesn't create a um, thick layer in your mouth either. It kind it, of melts even yes. though it has the butter. Butter taste. Yeah, it's it's butter, but it doesn't contain the. F no, true. You can taste the olive oil a little bit, mm -hmm. and uh, the herb salt is really delicious. Yeah, it's the one I make myself. So, great make move. a sandwich. Yes. <laughs> and here we have the butter. 